Weather and fishing go together, sometimes not the way we want them to. Today we're going to be talking about that. On my Navnet TZ Touch system, I've got a free Nav Center weather forecasting service built into it, as well as a subscribed Sirius satellite weather service. But to explain it to you a little bit better in depth, let me send you to the studio to Eric Kuntz. He's Faruno's Senior Product Manager. Thanks, George. The unique thing about Navnet TZ Touch is the capability to bring in two different types of weather forecasting services. The first is our traditional Sirius subscription-based weather forecasting service, which is compatible with VX2, Navnet 3D, and also TZ Touch. But Navnet TZ Touch really allows us to leverage its built-in Wi-Fi port and go out to a new free service we call NavCenter. NavCenter is a web server on, on the internet which you can download free weather information on a daily basis or on an hourly basis for as long as you own the system. The unique thing about NavCenter is we use the built-in Wi-Fi system and if you're at your marina, you can simply request a weather update anytime. And the unique thing about NavCenter is the capability to bring in really unique fishing information such as photoplankton data, where the plankton is in the ocean. You want to know that because plankton is what starts the life cycle. If you have small bait fish eating plankton, and then the larger predator fish will naturally follow that. So if you know where the plankton is in a given area, you're going to catch more fish. Furthermore, we also have the capability with NavCenter to download information like altimetry data. And altimetry data is different than sea surface temperature, which can change with cloud coverage, because altimetry data is actually the temperature of the entire water column. So as the temperature of the water column increases or decreases, the actual level of the ocean surface will go up and down accordingly. And that's really important information because unlike sea surface temperature, you want to know where the fish are in the water column and the temperature of the water column will tell you that. Now let's go back to the boat and see how we bring all that information up on TZ Touch and we'll use it to catch more fish. So let's go in and let's connect the TZ Touch MFD to your wireless router at the marina. So I'm just going to press the home button. I'm going to go in and press the menu key. I'm going to say wireless LAN settings, select, and boom, I already have wireless turned on within the system, and the wireless mode is connect to an existing system instead of making it your own you know, point-to-point -point system like with an iPad or an iPhone or an iPod. And I just say connect when I see this LP Marina Secure. And what it's going to do is it's going to prompt me for the password. So I happen to know the password, which I'm going to type in right now. Now TZ Touch will go ahead in and handshake with the router. We have a nice strong signal right here at your, at your current slip position. It's going to go in and say, okay, here's my password. Boom. Once it locks in, it'll give us a little checkbox saying that everything's good. You see what happened? It handshake and it actually came up with a little green check mark. Now we can actually use wi the, the Wi-Fi system's capability to go into Nav Center and download things like chlorophyll data or plankton data. We can also grab uh, ocean uh, altimetry data. These are things that aren't even available in, Sirius, in the Sirius system you have, but they're freely available as long as you have an internet connection on your TZ Touch system. And this thing's going to remember it. It's already in there. Look, we've already established a connection. I'm going to close this out now. Or actually, let's go and just check out the weather, make sure we have it set up properly. So right now I'm set for my weather data server set for Sirius. And that's fine. We can use Sirius weather or I can switch it back over to Nav Center. And with that wireless connection, that's free weather for, for the life of the boat. So I'm going to check my forecast model. I don't need a lot of days because we're going to come back here fishing the next couple days. Right. So my forecast is only four days. I don't need to download a big file, but I just want to go ahead and double check that I have everything enabled that I want. And you notice we want plankton. We want altimetry data, which is going to give us those spin-offs of, uh, of, the, of the Gulf Stream eddies, uh, oceanic currents, sea surface temperature, basically most of the same information that we can get from Sirius, we can get freely with the Nav Center feature wow. in, in TZ Touch. Wow. Exactly. And a few things that Sirius doesn't provide, which are your money makers too, like sure. altimetry and plankton. Sure. So I'm going to close that out right now. Let's go in and go to our weather page, which is this dedicated icon right here that will always show up in TZ Touch. Let's go out and zoom out a little bit and go out here off the off the coast. So I'm going to zoom in a little bit. We if you uh, if we know where we're going, we can just pick an area, say about that size. Hit the enter key, go down and get say get the latest weather. Right now TZ Touch will connect 
to the weather server, download that data, all in a few seconds, all freely available, and boom, we're good to go fishing. And this is super important because we're going to know what's going to happen throughout the day. Absolutely, yeah. yeah. So we'll have a forecast of a couple days, but getting the most accurate every, uh, information every day is what's really important. But you know, the weather changes, the fish change. Absolutely. You know, we need to be ready for that. That's the way to catch more fish. So it's preparing to send the data. It's already got it. It's already connected with the weather server. Man, that was quick. Just like that. Download it just like that. Yeah, huh? You can literally download weather files that, you know, in 20 or 30 seconds that would normally take, say with a serious system where it's just on a, re a revolving pattern, maybe an hour or two. If you have a Wi-Fi connection, you can go and grab that data in literally 20 seconds. And you know, when you see stuff like that, you can see trends developing. You can see uh, maybe maybe even stuff that might be happening. Absolutely. And one of the great things about, you know, we did a four day forecast. So what I can do is I can go in and turn on any one of those parameters that we already uh, downloaded and animate them with TZ Touch. Really? It's really simple. Mm. Let me just show you real quick. So if I go in here and just select some of the data that I want to look at, say uh, in this case, let's look at pressure or sea surface temperature and wind and cloud data, for example. Now if I want to an animate that data, I just go over here and literally press the play key. Oh. And you can see how, how, how all that data changes over the next couple days. And you've got a toolbar that is scrolling across Absolutely. here. Absolutely, and if I, if I want to pick a specific time when I want to go fishing in the future, I can drag that back and forth and go anywhere on that line and you can see exactly what's going to happen on the time you want to fish. Holy mackerel. Really you can simple. see the isobars and everything moving. Absolutely. Man, oh yeah. man. Same thing with plankton, same thing with altimetry. You know what's great about this, and this is all this is all wireless. Yes. Say you're sitting somewhere in the Bahamas where you don't have local weather. Yeah. Now you do. Exactly. You can now get you it. do. Yeah. Yeah. Wow. Even if you have to tether your cell phone to it, it's really pretty simple. Which is fine. As yes. long as you've got wire. Absolutely. You're going, as long man, as you man. have a connection. You know, from a fishing standpoint and a safety standpoint, this really is priceless. Absolutely. Cool, 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 cool. Man, oh man. For more information and more stuff, more neat tricks you can do with your TZ Touch, check out www.farunousa.com.